afternoon. This is our second full day here in Porto. And this morning, kind of got a slow start, brewed some coffee, ate some breakfast. So we're going to grab a late lunch at a restaurant. We're fast walking there because it closes soon and I don't want to miss it. And I don't want to miss lunchtime. I'm a little stressed out. Okay, so we just got done with our lunch at M. Carne Viva, the vegetarian high tone fine dining establishment over by the Casa de Musica. And what'd you think? Personally, I didn't like it. I think it was just really fancy and quiet in there. We were the only two eating there. And then I'm actually still kind of hungry. It wasn't a large quantity. And I just, I would have rather stayed home and had a PB&J sandwich. Harsh. Well, now we're gonna hop on the metro and go into the historical center again today and have a little walk around, maybe have some coffee. Places and getting ahead of places, so we're back on track. We're gonna go do number six, 
and keep going. <laughs> wrapped up our audio tour and we just received our wine the moment that we have definitely been waiting for this whole time we each got a white and a red that we're going to try in just a second mm -hmm. it's good i like that it does not taste like wine does not taste like Flavored liquor. <laughs> wow. So, this port wine is kind of reminiscent of cough syrup, but in a good way. Did you ever look at that little baby bird and think that's peacock? No, it's the cutest baby. I can't. I've had two glasses of port, so I'm just like enamored. <laughs> <laughs> spicy food we just miss it so we looked it up it's got decent reviews and we're just gonna give it a go wish us luck Oh, my God. 
then maybe like six. 